If I told you there was a probiotic that was clinically proven to relieve IBS symptoms, improve digestion, and promote better immune function, you'd probably believe me, right? Of course you would. But what if I told you that there is one species in particular that not only had all these benefits, but it also produced blood cleansing enzymes in the digestive system? Well, now you might be skeptical. Hi, I'm Danny Curtin. Thank you for joining me today. Cardiovascular-related deaths are exploding worldwide, and it's affecting people of all ages. Even worse, sudden excess deaths have been rising at an alarming rate. But people are waking up to these disconcerting facts, and they're protecting themselves with better diets and exercise, more skepticism of the medical and pharmaceutical industries, and they're supplementing with a wide range of natural, safe, and effective dietary supplements. One of these supplements is the blood cleansing enzyme natokinase. This enzyme comes from natto or natto, an authentic Japanese dish of fermented soybeans, which has long been used as a folk remedy for issues like poor circulation, chest pain, and painful varicose veins. But the most active part of natto food is the isolated enzyme, natokinase. For the past several decades, health-conscious consumers have enjoyed the cardiovascular benefits of natokinase, like supporting healthy blood pressure, healthy blood viscosity, heart function, fibrin regulation, and normal blood clotting. You'd think most people would know about something that has so many health benefits. But sadly, our entire system is flawed. When news organizations that are supposed to inform the public about these types of remedies get the bulk of their ad revenue from drug companies, they aren't in a hurry to ever talk about safe, natural, and effective ingredients that could potentially create competition for their sponsors. So, natokinase has maintained its status as a novel and somewhat niche ingredient. It's not a conspiracy, it's just business. But there has been a shift. Consumers like you are getting news and information about their health from alternative outlets, like this show. And with such a rise in cardiovascular events, the popularity of natokinase has grown exponentially. Many industry insiders believe that this enzyme is the next big mainstream supplement. If that's true, worldwide cardiovascular health will completely change for the better. Now, what makes natokinase so safe and effective is that it provides the necessary tools the cardiovascular system needs to keep the blood healthy. Natokinase is not a blood thinner, like Coumadin or Eliquis. These drugs disrupt the coagulation cascade and prevent the blood from clotting, even when you may need to clot, like after an injury. I like to refer to natokinase as a blood cleanser since it enhances our body's natural blood cleansing system, which primarily consists of breaking down excess fibrin, the major protein responsible for blood clotting. Fibrin digestion and elimination is part of a continual enzymatic process that occurs throughout our entire lives. It's this process that regulates the blood's viscosity, or its thickness and stickiness, which is the ultimate factor in determining how easily blood can flow through the circulatory system. However, many natokinase users are doing something unique. They're not only protecting themselves by consuming natokinase directly, but they're also taking an additional approach to heart protection through the microbiome. Recent studies suggest that supplementing with Bacillus subtilis, the probiotic responsible for creating natto food and the enzyme natokinase may enable the human digestive system to naturally produce natokinase and other health-promoting substances like enzymes, prebiotics, and vitamin K2. The theory is that supplementation with Bacillus subtilis, which I'll refer to as B. subtilis, essentially mimics the natto fermentation process, but it all takes place in the human digestive system. This idea is definitely fringe, but it makes complete sense, especially when you look at the research surrounding microbiome health, cardiovascular disease, and supplementing with probiotics like Bacillus subtilis. We know that the microbiome influences the function of every system in the body, and that there's a massive gut-heart connection. The healthier the digestive system and microbiome, the healthier our cardiovascular system. One way this connection works is through the production of metabolites. For instance, the gut metabolite trimethylamine, or TMA, 
forms when pathogenic bacteria like E. coli feed on choline, which is a nutrient found in red meat, fish, poultry, and eggs. In the liver, TMA gets converted to trimethylamine N oxide, or TMAO, a substance strongly connected with forming artery-clogging plaque. Those that have unhealthy microbiomes, where microbes like E. coli are dominant, make far more TMAO. But it's healthy probiotic bacteria like B. subtilis that crowd out and neutralize these unwanted pathogens, which limits the production of plaque-promoting metabolites. So you can see how supplementing with B. subtilis supports cardiovascular function. But aside from the indirect relationship B. subtilis has on improving the cardiovascular system, a 2020 in vitro study specifically looked at the fibrinolytic characteristics of B. subtilis. The researchers found that B. subtilis not only produces the fibrin-dissolving enzyme natokinase, but that B. subtilis was able to dissolve both whole blood and euglobulin clots. Essentially, clots that are formed from the full range of blood components, like red blood cells and platelets, to those created in a lab setting. Wow. And finally, another 2020 study showed that B. subtilis supplementation improved blood lipids and endothelial function. Proper endothelial function in B. subtilis users means that blood vessels responded appropriately to stress and were able to dilate properly. Most cardiovascular issues arise when the endothelium isn't pliable. It begins to stiffen and then crack from the never-ending stress of blood flow and pressure constantly changing. So with all of these benefits, it's obvious to me that supplementing with B. subtilis is another way to support cardiovascular health. And I think it's safe to assume that something really cool is going on in the digestive system when B. subtilis is present. Is it turning your gut into a natokinase producing factory? I can't be certain, but the benefits of this probiotic sure make it seem that way. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like it and share it with your friends and family. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you'd like to watch another educational video, click right here. Again, I'm Danny Curtin. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.